So these are the items that you're going to need. You're going to need a foam head, some string, a pair of scissors, and remember, you might get glue on these, a pin, and some kid glue. Any glue that you have, I use Elmer's and a comb. And the last thing you're going to need is a straightener. Oh, and a wig cap. Now, set your straightener for 15, 10, basically low. You're going to need your hard surface, table, and a wall. Now, put your pin in and then go back to your table and take 6 inches of your favorite yarn and cut into 4 pieces. Now, wrap your yarn around the pin like you're tying a shoe. And pull it tight. Now take your straightener. This is optional. I think it makes it way better and easier to comb out in the long run. Now take your comb and repeatedly comb it till it is really fluffy or to this smoothness and then you straighten it. Now you will have a little fluff, just throw that away and keep combing. So you know you will be done when you can run your comb all the way through really smooth. So if you do not want to strain it, it will look something like this. When you're straightening, remember to press really firm and hard onto the straightener. You do not want any bumps in your wig. Now give it one more comb, and if you like it, keep it. If you don't, straighten it again. Now put a layer of glue onto your table, and then break your glue stick, but that's okay. Now that you have your hair, hold it and cut it. Next, you want to place it down and tap it with your scissors, so that way it doesn't get stuck to your fingers. Take your glue again and put another layer on. Depending on your layer, you can either sew it or glue it on. So I'm going to use a liquid fusion glue, or you can use Elmer's glue, or sew it on. If you're going to glue it on, remember to stretch your wig cap onto the foam head because it's going to stick to it so you want room to reach in and unstick it. So take your glue and put it over the other one and make a straight line over your dots, basically your plotted out wig. Now, if you are impatient like me, it is okay to take it off if it is still wet. And remember to cut out any unwanted glue or hairs that are sticking out. You want it to be straight. Now, place it onto your big cap. Try not to stick yourself to it and use your scissors to tap it down into the glue. Now once you're done with that, you want to take your glue again and you want to put a layer right on top. Now once you made a mess of your desk, don't forget you are almost done. And don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below of what I should do next. And now the final step is once it is dry, stick your finger into the wig cap and unstick it from the foam head. Now if you don't know what you want for the plot of your wig, now you are done. So if you don't know what kind of style you want, I will leave a link down below to some doll wigs that plot out their wigs and they'll show you how. Thanks, bye guys!